Hey guys, what's up? So, I just want to give you guys a quick update on what's going on. I'm in this room by myself, but um, made my daughter's appointment. So, I've lost 11 more pounds. So, I'm down 42 pounds total in about four months. Um, I started my journey back in October of 2020. And I decided um, a couple months before that that I wanted to go ahead and try to have the weight loss surgery again. Um, I went through this process. This is like my fourth time going through this process. Um, the last time I went through this process, I actually completed the whole six months and everything. They got approved by the insurance. Couldn't lose the weight for the doctor. Got discouraged and just gave up. Um, and I just felt like that. If I wasn't ready to do it then, I kind of regretted it at first, but... If I was ready, I probably would have gained the weight back. So, at this point in my life, I'm 35. I'll be 36 in August. And I just feel like that um, I'm in a space now where I'm mentally prepared for this journey. So, I'm down 42 pounds. Um, I've started working out at the gym at Planet Fitness. i got some videos coming up of me working out and stuff. Me and my husband. Um, and my kids, we all go and work out together. My daughter, she will be, what, 16 in September. And my son will be, um, and my son will be 14 in June. Um, I was trying to see if she was already done. But I just want to get on here and just give you guys a quick update. I am still taking my metformin twice a day, 500 milligrams, twice a day, once in the morning, once in the evening. Um, I don't have diarrhea, I'm not constipated, nothing like that. Um, I'm still taking my spirolactone. I take two 25 milligram pills of that in the evening. That's my water pill slash blood pressure pill. Um, and that's supposed to help my hydrate and I just the little things I get under my arms. Um, that's doing a lot better. Um and I also take um my fentramine once a day and that's in the morning, the thirty it's like thirty seven point five milligrams. Um, so that's the only thing I'm taking right now. Um that's the only thing I've been taking. Um I started with the blood pressure pill and the metformin back in October. And then in the end of December, I started the fentramine. So, um, I'm just taking it one day at a time. Got some workout videos, I'm gonna um, start posting. Um, I really found me a little spot at the gym that I like because I got the, it's a 30 minute workout area. And it's easy for me to do. Um, most of the time by myself and I can work full body and it feels good um, I did a little walking last night on the treadmill but my back was hurting so I got on the bicycle and I was able to do that last night last time I got on that bike I was not able to do it because my knees um, I'm not using my walker right now so that's another gain that I have um, I was finally able to take it out of the trunk and I put it in the uh, in my storage and so I'm excited about this journey I feel like this is the longest I've been consistent um, I just feel like that you just have to See, we find out what works for you and take it one day at a time. And if you look at my face, you can really see a difference. So if you go back to a couple of months ago and you look at how chunky my face was versus how it is now, this is how I can really tell that I'm losing weight. Um, I have lost, I went down two pan sizes and I went down, no, one pan size and I went down two shirt sizes. Um, so this shirt is a 2X and normally I wear like a 4 to 5X depending on the shirt 
but I got I'm able to buy two X's now. Um oh yeah, I started at four hundred and thirty-one pounds. Now I'm three hundred and eighty-nine pounds. Um I really just been weighing myself once a month when I go to the doctor so I don't get really caught up in the scale or anything. Um but I'm just going to go ahead and post this video. And I just want to give you guys an update. And last month, I didn't post a video. I ain't going to lie. I got a little discouraged because I only lost like five pounds last month. And I know some people are like, well, you still lost weight. I did. But um, I think it's because of my cycle as well. Um, it's really bloated. And um, I wasn't feeling too good. But, um... You know, with PCOS, those cycles, they come and go. You never know. But, um, just wanted to come on here, give you guys a quick update, let you know what I got going on. Sorry my face is peeling. I did a scrub and stuff. And when my face, you should see it yesterday, my face was really bad. So I still got a little peeling left to do. I gotta do another scrub tonight after I work out. Oh, I also bought some sweet sweat. I have to find my band my for my stomach for some reason. I don't know where it is. Um, I also saw one that um, I have a vest and then it's got the tummy thing, but then I saw one that does your thighs. Um, you put it around your thighs and your stomach and then they got the little arm things too so I, I want to probably one of those um i think the arm and the the full the 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 tummy the thigh and the arm bands set together it's like 135 or something like that let me see if i can show you what i'm looking You can't really see too good, but I'm trying to show y'all that sound from. But um, I just want to say hey, and I'm on TikTok. <laughs> um, I'm trying to post a little bit more on TikTok because it's easy for me to not have to edit. And well, I edit a little bit, but it's like a one minute video. How much editing can you do for a one minute video? Unless you just be extra. But I just wanted to say what's up. If y'all got any questions, y'all want me to talk about anything, answer any questions, just leave it in the comments below. And I'll see you next time.